Hey guys, it's Annie. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we have some new Huda Beauty makeup. Well, I guess technically this is from Wishful. This is the Wishful Eye Lift and Contour. This is probably gonna be my quickest video ever since this is just one product. But this is the serum. It looks a little complicated. Oh, so this is a refill. So I guess this top just screws off. So this is the tip of the product. And I'm assuming you, do you twist this or you push it up? You guys see that? So it looks like I'm supposed to apply it like this. Oh. It feels very nice. With the metal tip on here, it's very cooling. And the gel just feels really nice. It doesn't feel sticky or greasy. I'm just doing one pump for each eye. I'm really excited to see the effects of this because Huda was talking about how this product actually saved her from getting eyelid surgery, which I'm assuming like a lower blepharoplasty is what she was talking about. This didn't seep completely into my skin. I do feel like a little bit of tackiness. I mean, which is great if you're gonna apply makeup because it should stick a little bit better, but I just wanted to let you guys know. So this is a 1% Bacuchiol and peptide serum. It's a lightweight serum that instantly lifts, firms, and deep puffs the eyes, thanks to matcha, peptides, and innovative pululin, which is a natural film former that tightens the skin surface. Wow, I do really feel like it depuffed. Especially this eye gets puffier than this eye. I don't know why. But it says this is suitable for all skin types, even sensitive skin. It has a cooling Zamak tip that helps depuff and gently massage the eye area, which I said this is cooling. I guess it's not metal. And like I showed you guys, this is refillable. So just the tip part comes off and then it plugs into this guy. So I think it comes with just the one refill and then obviously you can buy more. It's fragrance free, vegan friendly, and drying alcohol free. It also has Arabian Jasmine, which which is really interesting. I already told you guys that it snatches and lifts, it also depuffs, contours, and firms, but it also brightens dark circles and it helps soften fine lines. This is $45, which I think is a great price for this, especially if you're someone that suffers from puffy eyes. I definitely do. It's weird. I guess it just depends on how well I sleep the night before, but like random mornings, I wake up with super, super puffy eyes, but this worked really well. The refill is $21, by the way, which I think is great. They're not making you pay full price for the refill. I'm gonna do my makeup real quick and then I'll come back to give my final review and see how it wears underneath the makeup because some serums just don't blend well with like your regular makeup routine. So I'm interested to see. All right guys, here is my makeup finished. I just realized I'm wearing a white shirt on a white background. But it's fine. <laughs> my makeup laid really nice on top of the serum. It doesn't look, I was expecting it to be like a little, sometimes you get like the beaded up look or like patchiness. It looks really good. I have a little discoloring right here just because a little bead of my mascara dropped off and I tried to wait till it like crusted up to get it off. So it just has like a little spot there. I tried fixing it, but it's not going anywhere. I really like that the serum depuffed my eyes and it's lasting. Like I was expecting me to do my makeup and then kind of have the effect come back, but it's doing really well. And it's been a few hours now. I'm, I'm making this video a little bit later, but yeah, I really like it. Let me know if you guys have tried it or if you're gonna be ordering it. It is in stores, let's see. It's available online on the 23rd of May and then in stores on June 13th. So yeah, let me know what you guys think of this video in the comments down below. Make sure to give this video a like if you liked it. That really helps me out. If you guys are following my whole rhinoplasty journey, I know I put my video out like going over like the pre-op and everything like that. I think the final video where I take you on like the journey where I actually get my nose done, it'll probably be out like June 11th. I think that's that Saturday after I get the surgery. So I'm really excited to share that with you guys. I'm so nervous, but this is one of the last times that you're gonna be seeing my nose like this. So say goodbye. Okay. I love you guys. Um, yeah. Bye. <laughs>